fucking smug look on his face. <laughs> fucking Josh, man. <laughs> <laughs> that is the face of a predator right there. You cannot convince me otherwise. Look at this dude, man. <gasps> that smug just yeah, that's right. That's right. This is what it's like everywhere I go. <laughs> Attention, YouTube. It's your sexy goth bad boy, King Cobra JFS. I love snake bones more than I love balls and its parts and its gravy. <clears throat> Warlord's big, big, big ass butt. Sean. Oh, I see what you did there. Ah, yeah, yeah, you did. You did see what I did there. Yeah. In the beginning, I labeled it the Mall Goth era when Josh was first starting out. And I thought that he was peak goth around this time. He had the metal claw. Oh, yeah, the metal claw. That was definitely an Ozzy inspired purchase. Ozzy used to wear one of those, right? Really? Yeah, at, oh. well, yeah, one hundred percent. Ozzy used to wear one of those, yeah, finger fucking claw rings or whatever. You get a real nice look at the gauntlet here. It's got a mean face on it, skeleton face. Oh yeah, skull face. And I had completely Holy forgotten shit. that he rocks it's the that bandana. bandana. Yeah, it's the bandana when it was new. Yeah, it's still white. Holy shit! Yeah, that thing got gnarly. He was rapping, and he used the line, uh, put a BB in your pee-pee. Oh. Oh, gangster goth. What, what? Gangster you know what? goth! You motherfucker, I'll bust a BB in your pee-pee, motherfucker. I miss the rectangular glasses. I think they made him look a lot more normal. I don't know if the prescription was more forgiving, and they didn't have a telescopic effect. His eyes have probably gotten worse over yeah, the years. Yeah, absolutely. I have to imagine. He wrote goth yes, in Sharpie on the shirt. I, how have I never noticed that before? <laughs> Customized. I'm, I'm definitely familiar with this picture, but I did not ever notice the goth. <laughs> I love that of all his shirts, he picked an ACDC shirt to write goth on. I think it says a lot about how he is self-conscious about his music tastes because ACDC is so goth. You got to write on the shirt that it's goth. You got to remind people. Yeah. I think he got a little Let concerned. them know you're into real goth music like <laughs> ACDC. <laughs> In addition, he used to really shave his eyebrows. Look at this. Why? What the? F what? Yeah. I keep my eyebrows trimmed in the middle so I don't get a unibrow. He would go about almost halfway with these things. There's no taper or anything. There's a faint little mark of where the eyebrows should be. But yeah, he was doing this for a minute. I mean, no wonder he was getting fucking berated in high school. You look <laughs> insane, Josh. <laughs> yeah. Right? Yes. He looks nuts. It, it really makes you look unhinged when you are shaving the inner part of your brow for no good reason. Look at how much real estate there is in between those eyebrows. We need the Simon Cowell punishment cut oh, yeah. picture. Yes, we do. <laughs> Yes, we do. Need that shirt. Let's get that in right <laughs> now. Let's see. They may have edited this one. Maybe. Just maybe. But we've got the classic shirt here. <laughs> no, that's not edited. That's, that's legit. Yeah, but... <laughs> fridge mode. Shirt, a fucking skeleton, a skeleton playing a 
<laughs> Look at that shirt. He probably thought that thing was badass. Back when he wore a lot more colors. He had the reds, yeah. the blues going on. Yeah, look at that thing. Dude, that punishment haircut is absolutely classic. I love that thing. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Yeah, yeah. here now he's getting more goth. He's got the <laughs> he's got, he's got the parking lot bootleg Rob Zombie slash <laughs> Alice Cooper shirt on. Yes, you love. I that miss shirt. that shirt. Yeah. yeah, I miss that shirt. That was a good one. This is unreal what he's got going on here. The Sharpie nails, the tinfoil gauntlet on top of one of the fingers, and otherwise looking like a normal human being here. Yeah, just looking like a normal, edgy high school kid. Yeah, and man, I've talked about it so many times, but that's how I started out with this guy. Just a edgy little boy who will hopefully grow out of it. Spoiler alert. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I send myself a message to hey, me in the spo past. <laughs> Spoiler alert, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Once Whoa. pierced Yo, his ear. Bangly earring? Yeah. Yo, Cobra was an old school e-boy with the dangly earring? Look how painful it Yo. is, too. Look at the struggle. Yo. I got another shot here. That looks like a purple ear. Whoa! Yeah, I mean, ew! It's, it's ew. gross. I need to put up a warning for people because this is not pleasant to look at. That thing is full of blood. Yo, yes, warning. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking disgusting. <laughs> Fucking disgusting. <laughs> Fucking disgusting. <laughs> Fucking disgusting. <laughs> it's the warning, right? There. <laughs> Yo, that does not. That looks bad. It looks really bad. That's, he may yeah. have done it himself. And oh, he absolutely did it himself with like uh, his stepmom's earring. Yes. That is mom's jewelry. That is a dangly earring, gang. Looks, one hundred percent, mom's jewelry. Looks real heavy. Like he would be very aware of the weight and the intense pain. He has to just be in just <laughs> agony right now because when they pierce your ears, they pierce it with a stud. So it's like, oh. you know, as as you know, light and non cumbersome as possible. You know, because <sighs> so this, it's just like every movement mm. and everything he does he just has to feel this 100 percent. got to take a picture though make it all worth it never mind that it is engorged and looking seriously painful they won't know. bloody bloody it's bloody yeah let me hop on facebook and show off my bloody ear real quick <laughs> He's got the sniped cigarette in his mouth. He hell thinks yeah. he's cool as hell. He, you can see it in his face. He really, really feels himself here. Looking good in some bathroom somewhere. You can see the diaper changing station behind oh. him. Get your ass to Spencer's. Yeah, Spencer's. Isn't that where <laughs> Josh got the his weed leaf earrings, right? Goth Felicia, was that her name? Yeah, Felicia. Not to be confused with fun size Felicia. I bought these two pot leaf looking fake gauges that I bought from Goth Felicia at Eastridge Mall. My right ear was already pierced, so I'm so pushed. When you understand the, the dark truth of how fun size Felicia got her name, it's pretty spooky. He was that yeah. into the girl who, uh, I Very guess, weird. sold him the earring. Pez. Pez video? Pez. Oh, Pez. I think one of the earliest appearances of the dog collar. Dog he had collar, that thing back. Yeah. Then. Wow. That's what's the rocking. Thin on. one. He's graduated to the uh to the pit bull. The big dog boy. Collar yeah. Now. Yeah. Again, I was surprised that he had it this far back because he wore this into the new apartment as well for quite a while. Yeah. And uh, yeah. as he filled this is, out, this is uh, starting up with the long hair too. Yes, yes. Or starting back up, I should say. That's a very good segue 
into what I called the lesbian aunt era, where oh yes, he started growing his hair out real long. We got some very funny stuff out of this. Uh, rocking out the fang necklace. The fang necklace Old appears school. here, and Sean has his hat still. Don't know what became of that thing. Wow, look at this. <laughs> what a screen cap. He looks 50 <laughs> years old here. <laughs> it was a big video for him. Uh, it exploded on Reddit or something back in the day and had 30,000 plus views. What was the premise? What was he doing in the video? He was basically looking especially haggard and insane and playing his guitar. It was called Rockin' Out and it just went viral. What's the green thing? I think it's a... Never seen that. Maybe another bandana or some kind of bracelet. The one on the far right is a bandana, for sure. Oh, my guy is accessorized right here. He loves the arm accessories. He'll stack them. Spike bracelet. Studs. He's... Bro, our boy is peacocking right here. He is. A look at Pickup man. artist style. Plus the lip gloss that he was rocking around this time. Looking a little thick right here, too. Yeah, yeah, he got a little chunky around this time. Ooh. His weight moved was into that, fluctuating. Moved into that apartment and started eating nothing but a <laughs> hot pocket. <laughs> he was on a hot pocket kick. You're absolutely right. Steady diet of hot pockets for <laughs> me. <laughs> for meat and cheese. Yeah. Right? Isn't that the one he props out that he gave to for Stephanie? For Stephanie. That? That's the one. For yeah. me. For meat and cheese. How's our pocket, sweetie? It's for meat and cheese. <laughs> he was getting ready to go to a party. And this... <laughs> It's what? Great I have never seen this picture. <laughs> I have never seen this picture. <laughs> Dude, a couple more. leather jacket? Yeah, man. What happened to that? I would love to know because you'd think he'd be totally into it, but he did not embrace yeah. the leather Whoa. jacket for long. Why not? Oh, he's got the trip pants. Look, you can see the trip pant trip chains. Pants. He loved his trip pants he back did. then. He did. He absolutely loved them. Leather jacket Josh is insane. Oh, the fangs. He loved those yes, fangs. Yes, he was. I've got another great pic of him and his fangs. Look at our boy. Look at his fucking hair. Yes. Look at that hair. Punishment <laughs> cut. No, that is post punishment cut right there he got into a special time where he was getting these huge arches up in the front with his bangs he loved it What's up, you two? matrix yeah man cool sunglasses big arches in the front but he loved it he would talk about how he was having a great hair day whenever it would get like that i had an awesome hair day today so i'm going to sexy. <laughs> Look at that shit. I know. He's into it. I love the Matrix look. Yo, we got a wand on deck in the back in the vice clamp. Ooh. What's really good? I never noticed that. Completely what? vertical. Yeah, he just got done spray painting that. He just, <laughs> <laughs> he just got done fucking <laughs> sending his upstairs neighbor to the hospital. More fangs here. Yes. Uh yes the the aunt look the very very feminine look for cobra which is amazing that you can say he ever looked a little bit girly yo but look wand on deck man Again. he was determined back then he really was he was making them wands god damn cobra go back to those wands that's a big boy too yeah Oh. oh, people want those wands back, man. These lathed wands ain't it. They ain't, people don't want this mini fucking table leg. No, they want any limp dick wands. They want a big erect one like this thing. Look how yeah. proud it is. <laughs> Hard at work. Making videos Trying. in between wands, apparently. Yeah. The, of course, the, the hair dye that was going on. The infamous hair dye video. We can work that in. But yeah. in Classic. addition, I love the aftermath. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh my god <laughs> there's one more here <laughs> i 
really like this one because you can see the you stain. See, yeah, on his on his ear, like under his sideburn, and like going to his <laughs> neck. The hairline, the oh. temple is looking kind of blue, and you know, I think you can see the eyebrow trimming on the left one here. No, you can. He was still doing the eyebrow trimming. This yeah. It's a good couple years later. When did he stop doing that? I am curious to know. I think these days he's finally quit it. Dude, he, and it's like that is not doing him any favors. It makes his eyes look further apart than they are. <laughs> yeah. Right? Like Freaking hammerhead you... shark kind of look. <laughs> the distance. <laughs> 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 hammerhead shark. <laughs> oh, shit. He gets these ideas in his head and he can't be stopped. He does get an idea that like <laughs> something needs to be done and he just, he won't stop. You know, no. he's the soap, tactical soap. No, it's going to get the ladies. You got to groom your eyebrows, gents. Oh, I love the look though. The blackest hair dye he could find. He'd done his eyebrows. He'd gotten all over his face. And being able to see the result like this is really satisfying. I think a lot of people haven't witnessed how it looked, how unnatural, uncanny it was. Like Charlie Chaplin kind of thing going on. A moderator on a fucking Danzig Facebook forum. <laughs> so, <laughs> keep it on topic, guys. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> he had bells in his bedroom. Did you know about this? Oh, yeah, he was, like, shooting the BB gun. Absolutely the right. Chris was shooting his bells. On my bed up there, you can see the bells. There's one. Of, this, she gave me this bell, she gave me that bell, that bell, that bell. The black one behind it, um, my grandparents found digging in their yard, so, yeah. That's why I asked Chris to stop shooting at the bells, because... They were given to me as gifts, and... That's why I asked Chris to stop shooting at the bells, because they were given to me as gifts. <laughs> stop shooting at the bells. Bells. Yeah, some bells. They were dug up. They were unearthed from the ground. Is that where Sean came from, too? Dug them up? Yeah. Blonde Josh is amazing. Blonde and green lipstick Josh? Oh. I don't know. Or is this just blonde? Green. It has to have been a mistake. I bet you he bleached his hair blonde to try and dye it green. Oh. And then he did not let the green, or maybe he did not let the bleach sit long enough. But then, yeah, it looks like it only took to the places that actually bleached. Yeah, that's oh, what you got to do. Otherwise, it'll yeah. look yeah. freaking mossy, dark, kind of... Just a, a total mess. It will not come out yeah. the way you imagine. See, every time I hit a wrong note, every two wrong notes I hit, I smack myself to reinsure piano. Just for playing, because I'm holding the piano. Trying to play Beethoven? Yes. Because <laughs> I think he was stuck on him being the uh, reincarnation still. Yeah, that's right. Struggling. Big struggle. I thought this was another dye job because this was, again, him on the keyboard dyeing his hair, and I think he tried to fix it because now it's not quite as natural color. It's very bright here. Definitely still a little lighter it's on Auburn. the sides. Auburn looking. Uh, he has something that I have deemed the vulnerable shirt. <laughs> the vulnerable the shirt. The vulnerable shirt. Too? Not professional at all. No, this is him exposing his feelings. Oh, that's why it's called the vulnerable shirt. That's right. He had a little, he had a cry in this one. It, Understandable, though. I think whatever this isn't gotten, my mom's okay. My stepmom, because you know what? If I would have lost her, dude, I would have, man. The other video where I thought it was kind of important, a strange coincidence, he is fessing up to cheating on Stephanie, and both Sean and Rusty are berating him. They are letting him have it. Seriously, what? 
You cheated on Stephanie. You're a loser. You cheated on Stephanie. <laughs> <laughs> the number of insults thrown his way is outrageous. Your videos, your guitar playing, your ventriloquism have grown stale. You suck so hard. Your life is pointless. You need to find the nearest gun and in your stick it in your mouth like a cock, suck it on it, and pull the fucking trigger. Do the world a favor and kill yourself. Just do it. All they do is yell at him and call him names and say he's dumb and his videos suck. Oh my goodness! That's I like love roast. that you. Have, I love that you have deemed it the vulnerable <laughs> shirt. He lets his guard down when he's wearing this thing. <laughs> <laughs> Just looking real smarmy. Got the big long dark hair. Welcome to my bookstore. Oh. Oh, I forgot about the, <laughs> the seat with the broken legs that he used to have. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that thing. <laughs> oh, my God. What a great my first apartment piece of furniture. Oh, yeah. This is some dumpster diving <laughs> furniture here. Oh my One chair, God. no that legs. That is the throne of Scotty Hackman. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a she looks like a chick in this. Like one. a really mean <laughs> bookstore owner. That's what I always think of. Like holy shit! Like yeah. Hey. <laughs> oh my god we look like he could work at fucking women and women first, the yes. Portlandia bookstore. Yes, exactly. <laughs> exactly. It's unfathomable that he ever took this form when you look at him now i think some people out there are gonna have their hair blown back looking at him in this yeah, form. he looks like a pretty boy he does i think he was really into it back in the day i mean his story of uh, a very special blonde talking about the protagonist and his uh, <laughs> double chin as he called it uh, long oh, black man. hair i think he was imagining something like this a very special blonde. Yes. Unreal. Yes. Unreal. <laughs> I got some kick-ass uh, trip pants, but this is this is not Whoa. the, Whoa. the lesbian aunt zone. The uh, look how big. Who those is are. that? That is Tammy. That was a one-night stand that he uh, bagged. Whoa, Cobra. Yeah, yeah. What's really good? He used to honestly get quite God a bit damn. of action no wonder he thought he was doing it big after stephanie yeah i had no idea this this is also some of that other picture energy of of the lady from earlier uh, yeah absolutely <laughs> uh, he's just always got that look like yeah that's right motherfucker God. Yeah, that's right. This is what it's this. like everywhere I go. I can't go anywhere without this happening to me, right? <laughs> that <laughs> the that same, type of vibe. Same energy. Amazing. Yeah. Oh, he gets smug. So smug. Yeah, he gets really smug when he's with a lady like this. That is great. I had no idea what Tammy? Tammy, yeah. Oh, man. There's Tammy, Amy, and Judy. They all sound like kind of similar to me, the flow of it and everything, but I believe this is Tammy. For Cobra, this is a piece of ass, you know? I'd say so. He wouldn't like me saying piece of ass. <laughs> Respect piece women. Of ass. That's my piece of ass. <laughs> <laughs> it's to the point where you get kind of confused, you get a little worried for her. How did you wind up in this predicament? Did you yeah, really choose this? Fuck? Damn, okay, Cobra. Yeah, after Stephanie. He kept it going for a little while. and Okay. I think that's why it's especially painful for him now, is that he used to be hooking up every now and again. Wow. I think he'd go to the bar. He might go to the sandbar or see why or, or wherever and, and meet somebody one drunken night and bring him back to the Cobra's Nest. That is wild. Yeah. Other than that, <laughs> long hair Josh kicking This it. is a classic. This is a classic <laughs> one. 
<laughs> he loved this one. He had this as his Facebook for a bit, right? Oh, yeah. This was a, a Facebook picture with the lipstick and the chi bowels and nice long hair. Still the bandana. We had not entered cowboy country yet. Somewhere in this territory, I'd say this is more towards the the aunt zone. Oh, he had the hat. This hat reservoir tip. <laughs> yeah, He's wearing a condom on his head. <laughs> the great hat. That's a good Whoa, one. is that the same hat? No this, way. This, I think may have been a unique beanie a uh, wool cap damn he's got that gordon's fisherman <laughs> swag <laughs> that rolled up a little more appropriate now when he's constantly eating uh, anchovies and canned fish big balls oh, yeah of, he and is oil. the fisherman he, <laughs> he is, is the, the gordon's fisherman <laughs> the fisherman <laughs> trust the gordon's fisherman oh. This the was shirt, the shirt. The shirt. You Wait, what did shirt. I refer to? The, I, the rotting the zombie rotting shirt. Zombie. <laughs> Rotty <laughs> zombie. Yeah. Yeah. Or just like a rotting court. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, not it's zombie, kind of like but... goo and tattered clothes and stuff. He loved this. Yeah. Thing. Great shirt. This is the classic. This is his classic? This is his classic, I think. Okay. Uh, yeah, I love this shirt. He doesn't insist on wearing it until the end of time, until it disintegrates, yeah. unfortunately. I don't know if he's going to uh, unearth this in a in a mildewed bag. <laughs> yes. We yes. can only hope. <laughs> oh, you're speaking my lingo, Ringo. Yeah. I love <laughs> CWC. Johnny. Talk. Yeah. Johnny Ringo. Johnny Ringo. <laughs> This was a great era. This was when uh, Stephanie found him to be the most handsome was around the time of the doc. Yeah. Look at the way she's look at the way she's looking yes. at him right here. That look. She was really into him. Cobra, you blew it. Yeah, if somebody's going to look at you like that while you're doing a Sean and Saunders bit, my boy, you better hold on to her like grim death. You suck. Spoiler alert. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he did not hold on to her like grim death. No, no. He committed a very grievous sin in the back of a van for one cigarette. He threw it all away. If Stephanie was his peak girlfriend, this was his peak look uh, when he was at his best. The yeah. spiked neck, spiked wristbands. Yeah. yeah this, is, this is a classic Cobra look. I agree. Oh, hell yeah. Ripped. <laughs> Ripped. He's looking right at you. Look at that. Better not lock eyes with him, boy. Ripped. <laughs> you better look Step away. Step off. Step off. Coming through. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that is a look. Uh... <laughs> I used to love the bandana, the big flaps at the top. I mean, did he have a unique way of wearing it like this with I the big think, ears? Yeah, he wasn't. I don't think he was folding them properly in half. He pulls the top back more so you can fully see the skull on it. So. <laughs> yeah, big dog ears at the back. Yeah. And looking, man, the difference there is insane. That's. The, is the one on the right, that's the bandana from the basement, right? Yeah. Didn't we see it when it was white? Yeah. Oh Man, goodness. I wonder if yeah, I... that one for a long time. I wonder if I have that. Let's see. Oh, shit. Oh, no, it's different. Yeah, it's got the me. ace of spades. <laughs> on the left, he's in the classic chair, too. Oh, it's yeah. Up arm. Look at that taped uh, up arm. Homeboy Scotty War Memorial. Where the big <laughs> battle took place. Ew, is that why that arm is yes. taped like, like that? It got that stabbed. <laughs> the homeless battle <laughs> while Josh was working, working at Wendy's. He was at work and all this is going down. <laughs> I've been meeting yeah, yeah, you at Cobra Console because yeah, the other article talks about the battle. We have bandana, but... Solid snake style across the forehead only. Oh yeah, with his with his hair over it. Yeah, I love this video because this was during his uh, circle obsession. He started making a circle 
out of old drinks and was <gasps> ranting like a crazy person. Look. Oh, so he was making junk is what you're saying? Yes. They're taped cans. Yeah. He made a garbage wreath. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. We're finally out of the the feminine pretty boy phase. What look do we have next? Basically, as soon as we got into the hats, the cowboy hats. Yes, this is <laughs> this is one of my favorite fucking cobra hats. Let me go right now and yeah. find on Amazon. Austin three one six reports <laughs> pure crap, even for a costume expect. This is a piece of shit. <laughs> Came wadded up in a bag. Skull was plastic and already broken <laughs> off of the hat. Dude, this person predicted it for Cobra. Do not purchase this item unless you need something that looks like a black pancake. <laughs> 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 Mark R. Stoltz reports <laughs> squashed. <laughs> it's look at so it. squished. That Cobra wore it looking like this. Oh, is that look the blue? Look, that's how Cobra wore it. That is how Cobra wore his. Look at that. Oh. Pick his after I tried to <laughs> smash it. <laughs> <laughs> Team smashed up in a ball. <laughs> this is a literally. This is a Halloween prop. The material is a dead giveaway. It's some kind of polymer. It's meant to be thrown out when you're yeah. done. It's like plastic. Yeah. He not only started wearing cowboy hats. You can see the dog collar looks very fresh there. Oh yeah. Okay. So the hat and the big collar. The oh, big no. collar. The he, blood pants, too. The blood pants. <laughs> when he started distancing himself from the, the mall goth and the spikes, the T-shirt started to change, and he was always wearing that damn hat and the new dog collar. He entered a new era. Yeah, his cowboy from hell, as he as yeah. likes to refer to it as. Gothic cowboy from hell. I'd say, not coincidentally... His luck with the ladies started to take a turn for the worse by this time. <laughs> this is the beginning I, of the dry spell? I think this coincides with the beginning of the dry spell. When he started wearing those damnable cowboy hats and the big collar. I mean, honestly, it's a red flag for uh, potential suitors. You look at that and think, this guy's nuts. Look at that thing. <laughs> Now, I thought about walking into the beacon dressed like a goth cowboy with a black cowboy hat. <laughs> black cowboy hat, some fucking eyeliner, some nail polish, some black boots with some black spurs. Looking like a cowboy from hell or some shit. They'd be like, what the fuck are you supposed to be? I'd be like, I'm a goth cowboy, what's up? Cowboy from hell, get you some. I have the Aussie shirt, which appears to be around that time because he's wearing the... Yes. Uh, bandana. Yes, this is it's got long one hundred percent a Colorado <laughs> parking lot bootleg. Because when you go to Colorado, it does not matter what show it is; it don't matter who's playing. The shirts are gonna be tie dyed. I used to like tour manage bands and shit. And I'll tell you, it does not matter who's playing; shirt is tie dyed. That's how they get down in the parking lot in Colorado. When this thing was fresh, and it's very fresh here, I thought the color scheme didn't look that bad, especially compared to afterward. Oh, it's a great bootleg, man. That's They're going as cheap as possible yeah. with these. That's not screen printed. This is like... <laughs> And the tie-dye is probably really cheap, too, because that faded really quick. The design faded really quick. Like, to, Yeah, look. <laughs> this is the yeah. aftermath. <laughs> it's so different. Yeah, that shirt was just... It used to be like you pretty said, clean. Not, not built to last. No. Oh, look at the paint on Ozzy's forehead on the right. It's just like <laughs> completely worn off and just like, yeah, it's going. It wasn't meant to yeah, last. Uh, 
it, it looks cool, but you just you can tell it's cheap. <laughs> you just you just know. Got scammed. The very professional shirt. If you want to ever play a deadly drinking game, take a shot anytime Cobra says professional. That shirt looks very professional. He must say professional a good 20 times in this video. <laughs> professional. So this was definitely prompted by somebody who worked at the office bar and grill saying his shirt wasn't professional. It's just a big revenge video because they sent him home. And ironically enough, he is probably the only guy who identifies as goth. He gets sent home for not wearing black. That was the whole problem is he wasn't wearing a black yeah. shirt. And Irony. He comes home and just rants to YouTube about how wrong they are and that this is a very professional shirt. Yeah, look at it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's just like a shiny nylon Walmart brand Under Armour shirt. There's nothing professional about it. Like a workout, workout just, oh, I'm going to go play basketball with the... With the boys, you know? yeah. Yeah. Scotty and it's like, Darf going to play some <laughs> basketball. Oh, my goodness. Darf. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> you might be at a disadvantage. There's the belt. Look uh, at how oh, yeah. loose that <laughs> thing is. Tuck. Look at how he's tucked. The best comment. Someone in the chat says... You look like you're ready for a professional date. <laughs> <laughs> There's some oh. good fucking shit in that dressed for a job interview video. He's feeling himself. Like, he is. I think this just... one he says professional as well, uh, per the description here. Maintain that goth look, but a look that's professional and Oh my God! Very she professional. Did not go yeah. Her dress is professional for an interview, <laughs> but it's like it's not. He put on a black button-down shirt with clothes he would wear any other time. Reusing I mean, I the same components over and over again. Yeah, it's like yeah, Vietnamese exactly. Food. He's <laughs> always got the same like five ingredients rearranged. Yeah. Taco Bell. Cobra is the Taco Bell of dressing. <laughs> Like, I mean, <laughs> I'll give it to him in this video. He, he he looks a lot more normal than he's looked in a hot ass minute. He looks decent. He looks bathed. Yeah, like, he looks pretty clean. You already know. Obviously, he smells good. Oh wait, yeah, he adds he adds a bandana yes. to his job interview outfit. Instead of wearing my bandana tucked in on top of my head, I'll wear the bandana around my neck, tucked in on on my shirt here, and it looks really good. Got to recycle every component you got. Make it work. Turn it to an ascot. <laughs> he goes in this video, too, at one point. I got the... <laughs> I got the suave goth look oh, going on. Yeah. Suave. <laughs> it's suave. I got the suave goth look going right now. This one's a classic. He has a classic fucking freak out. He snaps and lets out a classic god damn it. God damn it. It like comes red. from the floor up. Yeah. <laughs> the floor up from the <laughs> bottom of his feet. Oh my god, I just spell empowerment incorrectly. God damn it! Yeah, says, uh, <laughs> now my fangirls are gonna get a shirt that's spelt wrong. <laughs> they're they're gonna be walking down the street and people what? are gonna <laughs> laugh that's at one. them. Fucking city! <laughs> Here we Great, go. now my fangirls are gonna get a fucking shirt that's spelt wrong. Yep. Fantastic. It's already happened. <laughs> wearing that shit, walking down the street, and people are going to laugh at him. There's no keeping it together this time. He fucking no. snaps. <laughs> this is 100% one of the first appearances of the pie high hat. Yes, it's really fresh here. Again, this is where he started to look unhinged and just crazy instead of like a normal human being. His fashion got weird. Oh. Yeah, when he entered his gothic cowboy from hell phase, 
Yeah, there had never been a more bonkers look in his repertoire. He was just peaking. <laughs> <laughs> I also like that this captures, I think, some pretty early homeless Vietnam vet energy that he's putting out. Absolutely. Master of the Dank Farts. I love that shirt. We haven't seen that one in a minute. No, he didn't hang on to that for very long. He has so many shirts, but he just like rotates the same couple of ones. Yes, he has a very specific set and he will wear them until they are dust. Almost a full month of the same but shirt. Can you imagine? That is, it's, it's fucking bonkers. Hugs my biceps nicely. 26 days, right? 26 days of the same shirt. 26 days. What a record. Unfortunately, we don't get to see the making of this one, like the female Goodis shirt. Yeah. But Goodis. The, the, the front is full of stock royalty-free images, yeah. like music notes, music notes, a weed leaf. <laughs> <laughs> and it's a tank top, so you already know he's talking about his biceps. my biceps. And down and yeah. talking about his huge-ass arms. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be stupid not to wear it for a month. <laughs> Must have been stinking up the joint. Big time. Yeah, I mean, this one probably disintegrated too. Gave out. Yeah, because we never saw this one again. He flexed too hard one day, and it just ripped open. Yeah, exploded. Hulk Hulkamania. He exploded it off his body. <laughs> <laughs> smelling oh, it. Smelling, smelling himself. It. Oh, he deemed it fine, because look, this he's, he's about to go another three days yeah. with this. A few more days left in that tank. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a phone smack there. Damn, Cobra. He's been smashing phones he out has. here. He has. <laughs> God, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the video is titled... Gothic, gothic coat. coat. Honestly, a gothic coat is a huge oversell here. It's basically the coat equivalent of the hat we were looking at earlier. It's just like a spirit Halloween store yeah. uh, pirate coat. It's a, it's a costume for sure. The fact that it didn't have buttonholes says a lot. He has to make oh. his own. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> he realizes there's no buttons on it and immediately starts to wait. Waste no time with it. Immediately. Yeah. Dude, he's customizing it. Yeah. Right By away. customizing it. What he just like starts tearing buttonholes into it with a buck knife. Make some room. Yeah. <laughs> Look at him. When he puts it on, he's feeling himself. He loves it. He starts talking like about like how dapper he is and shit. <laughs> I like that he had the peach fuzz at this time. That really adds to it. There's the, <laughs> the holy the point. knife. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. He just starts <laughs> Stabbing it. That's a shirt for Look you. Look at that. He tucks it into his pants. Yes. But since it's like knee, it's just like a knee length coat. You can see all the excess <laughs> fabric yes. bunch up inside the his pants. The junk he's putting away in there. <laughs> yeah, look at Stuffing it. Stuffing his pants. <laughs> Give him a big ass. Oh, he's got the ascot going again. Oh, with the, yeah, uh, the ascot. Yeah. Looking good. Throw on a vest. Oh, yeah, he tosses on the camo veteran fucking war vets. <laughs> this would be the kind of shirt you could wear to our job interview. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Look at that. Oh, wait, though. No, this. Okay, keep going. This video goes next level. <laughs> this video goes next level fashion. Do you remember? We are about oh, to get no. a lesson in goth makeup. Oh, and yeah. he says, don't do this. Sharpie. Yeah. We're getting some Sharpie eyeliner. Ow. I never... But that's, yo, yo oh. but that's not it. He keeps going. Yeah. He keeps going. Power up yes. some more. Wait, wait you, you don't remember. Oh, you're green. right. The green lipstick. No. 
Oh, he puts on some green. He looks like an absolute <laughs> lunatic. <laughs> <laughs> some people can pull it off. Some people can't. <laughs> this is as far as I go with the goth look. And some people can pull it off. Some people can't. Oh, I like this. Because this is him leaning back into the whole goth thing pretty hard. This isn't very yeah. cowboy. This is this is an insane outfit. But again, we never saw this coat ever after this. No, no. Threw it into some corner of the room, and that was it. Never again. Yeah, eaten by moths. Oh, yeah. here we go. <laughs> this is just another insane look. I don't think any of this stuff, uh, besides the gloves, ever made another appearance after this video. The gloves and stuff, maybe? The fingerless gloves? I distinctly remember him wearing the gloves one time. He was wearing them and eating Taco Bell. <laughs> and, one piece, and one of the pieces of Taco Bell fell into the gloved palm of his hand. <laughs> he just he licked it off like oh. it was just... <laughs> oh. <laughs> My favorite part about this one is probably when he puts the leather daddy hat over the bandana. Yes. Yeah, here we go. He puts the leather daddy hat over the bandana and <laughs> claims to have invented a new style. New style. Maybe <laughs> people start doing this. You never know. <laughs> but look yeah. at him, though. I just made a new style. Rocking the bandana and the hat. And maybe some of you would be like, oh, that looks stupid as fuck. And I'm like, you never know. It might catch on. Really enjoy the irony of him kind of looking like a leather daddy, like you were saying, uh, while also yeah. being insanely phobic of ever looking gay. Yeah, it, but he had no idea. Maybe that's why it never made another appearance. Oh, someone. Someone told him, yeah. Yeah. This is another more niche one, I would say. Yeah. Uh, yeah, look, at he's proudly displaying a fucking... Green, Rit brightest Ritchie green, yeah, chugging ranch. <laughs> <laughs> Watch, he struggles to get it on. He has to stretch it with his hands. He has over to make room for his head. <laughs> he got to stretch it over. Oh, his that's big old amazing! Bowling ball head. He, he has to make room. Falling ball head. Oh. <laughs> Look, then he has to roll it over the body. It looks like a youth medium. It looks way too small. <laughs> He has to make room for the collar too. <laughs> look at it. Look how it's, tight it is. Yeah. <laughs> it's so tight. Totally choking out. Oh, yeah. Look at that. He goes full flex down mode. This is the least flattering shirt ever. I don't think anyone can get away with wearing like a green screen like this. This is so bright. You could key him out. No problem. Yeah, you could. It would just be his head. Yeah. Wait, he also he says too. These are the kind of these are the kind of biceps that'll keep a lady safe at night. <laughs> <laughs> the ladies are definitely safe at night. <laughs> Fucking no one, nowhere near his ass. <laughs> Won't get within ten feet of this guy. Look at how green it is. It's so green. It's like a construction vest. Like, it gives some yeah. high visibility. Safety green. Safety green. <laughs> you just know it was too tight and uncomfortable because yes. he basically takes it off immediately after his pose down. It's going in the trash. That's never going to be worn again. A marijuana-friendly fedora. Oh, perfect. <laughs> yeah. Yo, and again, it is just way too small for his big old bowling ball head. He works so hard. The frustration Wait. is real. Hold on. It's so good. Oh, my God. Yeah. Wait, hold on. <laughs> it just sits right on top. Perched. A little garnish. It, it has no chance. Yeah, look. He, yeah, right there. I can't. I tried. I can't. <laughs> the mini freak out. Ow. <laughs> look at his face. <laughs> <laughs> he whips the fedora 
cagado <risa> <laughs> Yo, and this was back when he was still reading the chat, and yeah. someone mentioned something about how like it'll fit better, you know. Once you, you gotta know, once break it, it in, out. you gotta break he it goes, in. Else, maybe I can use the vice clamp to stretch <laughs> yeah. out. Like, he he braces his. <laughs> <laughs> this fool braces his foot and leads back to stretch he, it. Look, go back. Yeah, almost, I've got it. It's such a funny scene. The, he the almost foot. pulls. Yeah. He almost pulls the entire wand making bench thing totally yeah. off the wall. His body like weight. Off the ground or whatever. All else he could have done is like jumped on it with both feet and pull on it. Look at that. <laughs> The sound. It's a huge noise. They still try to convince them. They say like, oh no, yeah. it's supposed to tip down like a mobster. It's supposed to ride yeah. high. An old school gangster, gangster. villain. <laughs> Man. Hey, you guys. I mean, in hindsight, that fedora dodged a bullet, you know? Think about the way he treat It, it could have met the same fate as a pie I had, you know? Oh, yeah. War, worn until it was rotten and then beaten on the arm of a couch. <laughs> the way he lives, no hat stands a chance with him. Absolutely. Absolutely. No material is strong enough. He's a hat mass murderer. <laughs> Just a countdown when he gets the new one. It's a matter of time until it gives oh. out. Wake of shredded hats in his path. <laughs> <laughs> that giant head takes no prisoners. Wait, what is going on here? <laughs> he got the glitter oh, ball. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Such a good shot. There's so much. <laughs> That must have been on this floor until he moved out. Oh, yeah. Knowing Cobra. When they pulled out the carpet, I'm sure they were seeing bits of it all throughout. It's like sand from the beach. You never get rid of it. Yeah, nope. It takes it's ages. There. Oh, he's wearing the uh, 26 Day shirt. Oh, this yeah. Video. Crossover. Yeah, I got some overlap. Here yeah. we go. Cobra Craft jeans. I like that you paused it right there. This is important. I just say hail to hail to Satan. Hail to Satan. I get that it's probably meant to be an upside down cross, but Joshy boy, you got to understand, it looks like a T. Hail to Satan. What are the odds that he wrote it as Satin at first? Because he's guilty of that. He'll write Satin. satin. Yeah. <laughs> Satin. And I could see this being a sneaky job as well. The little O shape next to where the I would have been. Because it's smashed together next to the T on the bottom. Yeah, you might have It's like fixing a bad tattoo. He's very creative. He'll make it or, work. Or he just wrote it all out like that. It ain't... There's no telling with this These dude. things look... Yeah, and it's like... There's just giant bleach patches and then yeah. he spray painted over the bleach patches nice and stencil like, those are two things that will eat through your clothes <laughs> if not done properly <laughs> and neither was done properly bleach is going to eat right through yeah. that denim same with the spray paint because that's cheap denim we're talking Swimming just like pool. wrangler that's probably why they just disintegrated right off his body mid fucking birthday dinner at craves <laughs> <laughs> look at that knee blown out <laughs> oh yeah they're shredding apart those are the hilt satan yeah. ones the other pair he was wearing were different because he made multiple pairs. <laughs> did he throw out one because they just did not work out? I think, yeah, they just disintegrated when he put them on. Oh, just him shuffling yeah. around in these things, and you can see the tears opening and closing. Here we go. Look at Here that, we dude. Go. The, Here we go. It looks so thin. The material there. is 
gone. Completely falling apart with every move he makes. Oh. Bro, he wore those to Craves for the birthday for dinner. Craves <laughs> birthday dinner. Oh. oh and again, man. his fashion just continues to make him look scary and unhinged and crazy. That's where <laughs> it went. No, I said it, and this is... I mean, it's fucked up to say, but like, <laughs> if you saw a person just on the street saying the things that Cobra says, you'd think it was a fucking insane person. <laughs> oh, yes. This is yes! one of my favorite yes! for him. The welder's glasses post-op. Yeah, Doritos Locos Taco, that yeah. crunch, that munch. Crunch that munch. <laughs> He was wearing those with the pie eye. What a look. I he looks what like an absolute look. Like an extra, like a goon and Robocop or something. Like a Oh my a thug goodness. and a sci-fi yeah. movie. It was a great look. I love <laughs> these glasses. Back, a background thug. Yes. Thug <laughs> number three. <laughs> Thug number three. No. <laughs> See him in the credits. Oh, this is yes, this is, the one. this is the one. This is the crunch that crunch munch. Crunch that munch. My favorite. My favorite. Starting off with that nacho cheese Doritos Locos Taco, that crunch, that munch. There was a insane line that I'd forgotten about around this time. Talked about women giving birth. Well, babies are normally pushed out of a woman's vagina, and unless she gets a C-section, then they cut her stomach open and just pull it out. There you go. The wonders of life. It literally stretches her pee hole four to eight times the size to push out and it's just pushed out. His understanding of human anatomy here, it stretches the <laughs> pee hole four to eight times its size. And he gives the, the whole size he gives with his hand. <laughs> yes. A manhole cover. Maybe after this, he had another amazing look where he was in between eye surgeries. He yes. popped up in the Darth Lenny smelting video with just one lens. One in the smoky glass. lens. Yeah. And it was transitioned. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Could have had an eye patch like a pirate. I think he secretly wants to be a pirate really bad. But this... I mean, he dresses like a pirate. Look at the fit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's got. People suck. I need a beer shirt oh. on. Love that he doesn't like make the background transparent. No, he just like puts the whole black block. Oh, it's brutal. Oh yeah, this is Darf's crib. It's a family man's backyard. Got, got some bars of Maverick. <laughs> Picking up a freshly smelted aluminum ingot. Darf warned him, "Don't pick it up. It's hot." <sighs> Molten yeah. aluminum. Yes. <laughs> he <laughs> gets so far the with reaction, it. The reaction time was so slow. God, he's <laughs> ready to pick it up and have a hard look at it. Ah. Oh. Oh my God, look at this. <laughs> oh. It's long sleeved. Yeah. It's long fucking sleeved. Oh my goodness, he looks insane. What a he color looks on that thing. Absolutely nuts. That is such a look for him. Almost looks like leopard print or something, but then you get a real good look and realize those are scales. And he covers Scaled up. Scaled up. And it's him wearing the snakeskin. That's so funny. I think it might say fuck grape underneath. Yeah. It. I do see. I see that F bomb right there hanging out. I wonder if uh, if it'll lean back a little bit. Yep, it does say that. It says fuck grape. I think I know what it says. I, I think it says the legendary Gothic King Cobra. Fuck oh, grape. Oh yes, it does. Yep. It does. And it's chroma key green. And then a picture of himself in his snakeskin shirt. 
I love it. I love shirts that have the wearer's face on them. That's peak really? comedy. He's drinking out of the potion time glass in the picture, too. <laughs> that shirt is nuts. This one, God, when you actually see the detail on it, it's so good. But Museum made this. This is a troll shirt. Could you handle Uncle's Python? And that is, I believe, the guy who had sex with Stephanie. He's got Damien. This, Damien. I'm pretty sure that's Damien. Even in a Cobra doc where he's talking very positively about Cobra, he's wearing a shirt with a dude who had sex with Stephanie. Oh, uh, yeah, because this shot is from Now It's a Party. Yes. Yes. Oh, wow. I love that shirt. I honestly think I might yeah, wear that. Yeah, that's a great scene, too. That's a nice... <laughs> Cobra's just a... What's he say? Something like just another guy trying to... Trying to make it, trying to get <laughs> by or something. It's like you and me. Just trying to live yeah. our lives day by day. <laughs> <laughs>